power of interactive technology, you know, the web, uh, to ordinary people. And, you know, and I had this firm belief, which I still believe, that people are basically good. And as I said, if you, if you treat them well, and if you treat them with, with And in the modern world, despite, you know, we're bombarded with negative images all the time about how bad the world is, how dangerous the world is, and it is true, there are some dangerous things going on and there are some bad actors out there, but the vast majority of people out there are just good, decent, honest people. And so then I gave them, you know, so I gave them the tools to, to do business with each other, and what ended up happening right away um, was that a small fraction, you know, would start to have problems and disputes. And, so I thought it was really important to um, adopt, be clear about uh, adopting a set of values about how to treat one another, um, and try to encourage the community to adopt those values. And the very first way I did that was with the feedback forum. And this was sort of the very, you know, now, of course, everybody understands the feedback. Um, uh, there have been problems with the feedback forum that the company's you know, been working on and always improving, and there's always more it can do. But, in those days, there was really no, there was no example, there was no place for us to learn. And so it's just a, something I came up with, um, frankly, because I knew I couldn't handle all the disputes myself. And uh, uh, it felt like I was, uh, you know, I was the parent and little kids coming and complaining, you know, daddy, daddy, he did this to me, daddy, he did that to me, you know, this kind of stuff. So I said, you guys work it out uh, uh, together. And, um, but I will tell you that, that uh, you know, we have, now after billions of transactions, we have experimental evidence that, in fact, people are basically good, that they don't cheat each other, you know, that it's a small, tiny fraction out there that, that do, but the vast majority, 99.997% or 99 whatever, 2% of transactions go out without a, without a hitch, and that's experimental evidence. So if you're ever having one of those dark days about how bad it is out there, just remember, it's really, it's not. People are really, basically, good, decent people who always do the right thing when given the chance. And that's been so inspiring to me. And in fact, it is something that, that, that is, as I transitioned away from running the company day to day, which was a long time ago, I, I transitioned away from that to our first CEO, to, uh, to Meg Whitman, um, I focused on our philanthropy and this idea of, of uh, giving people the tools they needed to uh, create their own opportunity, to take advantage of that opportunity and build their lives the way they wanted. That's something that we do in our philanthropy. You know, I learned by watching at eBay, I confirmed this belief that every human being is born equally capable with the same potential, but what we lack is equal opportunity. And so our philanthropy over the years, we've created five organizations, we've committed well over a billion dollars now in that time to human rights, to education, to financial inclusion, to technology. Um, our philanthropy focuses on creating opportunity for people all over the world, uh, here in the U.S. as well. So, 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 so,